Hey everyone, Phil Beeman here doing formic treatments. I've been doing uh, June formic treatment most of the last 10 years or so. This year I'm using Formic Pro, which is a gel pad uh, foil sealed. I have used uh, Mite Gone, I've used uh, the meat pad sponges. Um, I feel in my area the risk of um, resistance. I've done an Apivar treatment, Amatraz treatment this spring, but I feel like I know I had some sites of mine that had uh, resistant mites last fall. So I'm up in my game a little bit, going with a professional product here. And uh, so you just unwrap them. Uh, sometimes I just cut the end off, but you can just also just peel it back. And uh, you're probably supposed to wear gloves, but I don't want to surround with that. <clears throat> Keeps the calluses on your fingers nice and strong. So I'm putting my strips at the second box level. Sometimes that means under the lid, sometimes it means under the first honey super. Uh, I know that uh, the recommendation is to put it right in the middle of the brood chamber. And I find that that's, uh, that burns a lot of brood. So I'm just going to do it like that. It's about uh, 10 degrees here right now, so just barely shirt sleeve weather. And then what I'm going to do, because I, my experience is that you get a, a real hot sun on the high, but you can really uh, burn off the fumes quicker. And the other thing is that that Formic will peel the foil off of my, my hive blankets. So I have put the strips under the lid and then we put the blanket on and then to hold that from blowing away we've put the queen excluder on top so we have that kind of little bit of a sun shield to uh, keep that lid from getting hot sometimes on a hot day you put your hand on that wood lid and it's it's smoking hot just from the sun so this is a little bit of a temperature control um, Formic is a pretty touchy product, even when it's uh, packaged uh, like that. It has a lot to do with the humidity in the air, as well as the amount of stores of honey. You have a real hive really full of honey. That's a very different absorption to the Formic than if that hive is pretty light. Mine are pretty light right now. We've been uh, feeding steady, but we've had very little foraging this spring. So if you look down in my in my homes, even though we got the bees for three boxes, I've got uh, relatively little honey in there. So there is some risk to this. So I'll follow up in a couple of days to see how they're doing. Thanks a lot, everyone. Have a great day.